Happy Friday, everyone. I'm Connor Woodard, and this is the Rookies Weekly Update. First up, we got the Corridor crew on YouTube talking to Eric Sandin, VFX supervisor on a little old movie called Avatar 2. They break down the most controversial shot from this trailer, which includes this explanation. She actually painted in the subsurface look for the lighting for that shot so that she got the proper color, the proper reds, all that stuff. That's only for a very specific angle for that to work. Yeah, we knew what the angle was. That actually just blew my mind more than anything. You gotta check that out. Also on YouTube, the Ask NK channel just released a video on Latent Labs HDRI generating AI tool. Personally, I think there are a lot of options on polyhaven.com that are completely free, but I can see how this could be very useful for a specific look. I'll leave the moral decision on whether or not to use such a tool completely up to you. The rookies have just released their 2023 report on the best creative media schools. I don't want to spoil the results, so you have to head over to therookies.co to check them out. You don't need to give any personal info to download it. It's just free, high quality information. The best kind. Speaking of the rookies, they've also updated their school directories with a more advanced search, global ranking, and certified school badges, which look and act pretty slick. Also, the student portfolios for each school are updated in real time, so you can see what the current batch of students are working on right now. Another resource I found for those that are trying to get a job in the games industry is Joe Burridge's LinkedIn page. He's the senior recruiter at Epic Games, and he's been dropping these videos on how to help people get into games. In this video, he explains everything you need to know about making your games portfolio stand out, and honestly, I completely agree with all of his takes. In jobs, Weta FX is hiring a fur groomer for their model team and they also brag a little bit about their intuitive over procedural proprietary groom system. It sounds like quite the privilege to work with. Hitmarker's LinkedIn page has curated and posted all of the jobs working on Assassin's Creed in art, animation, game design, and programming. Outpost VFX is hiring effects artists in UK, LA, and Montreal. Alex Gombos at PlayStation Studios has posted four different job openings. The first featured artist of the week is Marco Plouf for his amazing Elden Frog. Absolutely killer work. The material realism is just gorgeous, especially that cape. So much movement and those frayed edges. Ah, oh, looks fantastic. Up next is the explosions guy, Urban Bradesco, with this amazing Axiom fire simulation. I really need to look into Axiom because the stuff that's coming out of it is just really sick looking. If you want to stay updated, you can watch the weekly update as soon as it comes out on the Rookies LinkedIn page at 9 a.m. Pacific every Friday morning, where we'll be giving you the technology, job openings, and stunning artwork to keep you updated and inspired. And I hope you have an awesome weekend.